stage, we'll do a little Q and A session here. Come on, the first question. Kim, are you gonna make me run back there? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll go back here this time. Hello, Miss Kira. Hello, how are you doing? Good, how are you doing? I'm good, thank you. So you obviously uh, look fabulous and you have to up there, but you look such absolutely shocked when they announced your name. Thank you so much. Um, I, you know, it was just such an honor to be in the same category as, you know, Michelle Wright, Jada Dreyer, Carolyn Dawn, Terry Clark, who took me under her wing this year. She helped me learn so much, and I just, it's just, it, it was incredible to be in the same category as them, and to, to win is just, such an honor. All right, who's next? Oh, back to the front. <laughs> Getting a workout today. Yeah, we all are. Congratulations, Thank Akira. You. All the hard work. You've had a great, great year. Yes. Uh, tell me about the Carrie Underwood tour. It was absolutely incredible. Um, another amazing opportunity, the chance to share the stage with Carrie Underwood is unbelievable. Um, I learned so much from her as well and yeah, it's just, it's, it, it was an amazing experience. She was so gracious and so happy to have me. It was, it was amazing. The showcase showed us a couple of years ago, yeah. Female Artist of the Year this year. It's pretty cool. It's incredible, yeah. Thank you so much. No cry. I know, I just fixed my makeup. I promise I won't cry. <laughs> We were talking about this on the green carpet earlier. Uh, last year, winning the Rising Star, you, you felt kind of overwhelmed by the people you were competing against yeah. in that category. Uh, you've already done a great job of, of, of paying tribute to uh, the people that you shared the category with this year. Uh, I'm just wondering, then, like, do you feel pressure to live up to that now? I mean, you look at the roster of people who you just topped off. And you know, I mean, while I was doing my performance, I was, I was very, very nervous before. And looking down at, you know, all of my peers, they all had just the most proud smiles on their faces. So I don't feel any pressure at all. I know they're, I'm part of their family now, and that's all I've ever wanted. So I can't, can't thank them enough. It's incredible. Sure. Congratulations. Thank you. Hi, Kira. It's Hello. Jonathan from ET Canada. Hi there. Um, I'm curious, uh, you're so young, this is a huge achievement. Yeah. Where do you go from here? <laughs> oh gosh, um, to the party. <laughs> <laughs> After the party? Uh, um, you know, I just, I, I always have said I would do this if, you know, there was only one person coming to see me, so I can only hope that people will continue to, you know, enjoy my music and, and be fans and give me these incredible opportunities. Thank you. Oh, over here. It's going to get really close to you. Hi, Kira. We're tweeting live from um, Twitter right now. We do have a fan. We actually had a lot of fan questions come through oh, for you. Fantastic. One being, when are you coming to Brazil? But um, I thought those are awesome. I know that's incredible. One day, I hope. One day. <laughs> the question I do have for you, though, from a fan is, what is your fave song to sing live? Oh my goodness, that would have to be um, my song, Dangerously Obvious, because uh, I, I'm, that's always kind of been one of my favorites from my Love Me Like That album, but it's one that's just very, very close to my heart and kind of get emotional every time I sing it, so it's definitely my favorite one. Thank you. Thank you. Do you have any other questions in here for Kira? Oh, over here. Uh, Kira is 19 years old. Yes. You turn 20 next week. Yes. Are you concerned your career is moving too slowly? For you? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. No, it's it's yeah, definitely not. Um, it's all a little bit overwhelming, but like I said, you know, I just, I'm so incredibly blessed, and I have a really amazing team of people behind me, an amazing support system who help me, you know, take everything as it comes. So. I don't think so. Hopefully not. <laughs> you see other people like uh, Taylor Swift, for example, doing so well and so young and connecting and yeah. uh, do you see a bit of a parallel there in some regards? Oh gosh, I mean, I've heard the comparison to Taylor Swift a couple of times and I can only take it as such a huge compliment because she's definitely an influence for me. So, yeah, absolutely. Thank you. Right, it's so hard to see with these lights. I know. Anyone else have a question? <laughs> You again. <laughs> Hi, sorry. One more question. Okay. How important, with these comparisons to Taylor Swift, 
going on tour with Carrie Underwood. How important is it to you to maintain your own identity, especially when you get this kind of reinforcement? Oh, absolutely. Um, I mean, it's definitely very, very important, and I think that one of the main things that I, I definitely try to do is make sure that I always am in the writing process. You know what I mean? I'm always part of it. Every every song, except for one on my album, I actually co-wrote. So I think you know, staying true to the writing process and being a part of it is very, very important to that. Yeah. Thank you. Congratulations, Keith Gillard from Successful Media. Thank you so much. You're wonderful. Thank you. Uh, I, I, I wanted to touch on uh, what my colleague just asked about your, your writing, and, and uh, you're kind of sort of hitting it up the park now. Well, thank you. Putting it <laughs> in the paper. So well, where you. do you want to, you know, uh, it was mentioned you're 19, so, yeah. so how do you want your material to mature as you uh, grow into the business? Where do you think your writing is going to go? Well, I mean, I definitely would like it to, you know, grow with my fans as they grow. Um, I realize that uh, a lot of people, you know, consider me a role model, and so I always try to remember that, you know, there's lots of little girls at my shows and, and stuff like that, you know, so, yeah. Thank you. All right, do we have one last question? Thank you guys so much. Thank you. Thank you all. Artists of the year.